What music is that I hear? Something to try and make you feel at home. <laughs> Good morning, everyone. I apologize. I technically missed today, but today I'm going to do two vlogs one day. That'll be interesting. This will be the first half of the day, and then I'm just going to try to cut it up and give you guys the remainder of the event. So. Finally. Up. I've been wanting to get you in this like vlog series for so long now. When really? I knew we were coming out here, I was like, yes. Because how many are you doing? A hundred? A hundred and a hundred days. It's actually crazy. Props to this man. How much shit you sneak in? A lot. <laughs> a lot, a lot, a lot. What inspired you to cut the sleeves? It was too big of a shirt, bro. It wasn't tight <laughs> enough. It wasn't tight enough for me, it's so I cut way. the sleeves. Size, yeah. Large? Damn, you know how you fill out larges? I mean, it was like, damn, yeah. I ain't gonna lie. No, it, it was he tight. out larges, big boy here. It was it tight, bro, but... Big boy. This isn't actually, bro, your arms are huge. How the no. fuck did it not fill out? It did, but it just it it wasn't better. tight enough. Yeah, exactly. Like, it's gotta be, I, I wear like mediums and small. Just get that 3D, you know, 3D look. Thank you. Good. What up, dude? How are you? Shit, what vlog is this? 37. We in the 30s now? 37. Let's go. Vlog 37. Vlog party. Rent back. Oh shit. I took this photo. This is really sick. I would say this is the second time a photo I've taken has gotten blown up and like put on a billboard. So this is dope. This is sick. I love it. I'm excited. This is sick. Vlog 37? Oh, your vlog. Yeah. Vlog 37. 37,000 likes. <laughs> I'm, I'm expecting that. 37,000 likes. And I'll chop off my hand. <laughs> no, I'd, actually, I probably wouldn't. No, I wouldn't. Oh, okay, finally out of the chaos. My brain. It's only been three hours. We've only this event's only been going on three hours, and it feels it's been like a day already. There's a lot of athletes that when I came out here, I was like, oh fuck, I want to meet them for the first time. Uh, and then friends that I've had, and I got to see them again. I saw Jesse. Finally got to meet the Trend Twins in person. I met a videographer by the name of Drew Cronin, and I was very excited to meet him because he's someone who's really stepping up the standard for what we do here. Speaking of which. This is actually perfect timing. <laughs> I literally just spoke to the vlog and said one person I was extremely excited to meet oh, was yeah. Drew Cronin. So, What's going on, guys? Yeah, <laughs> Am I supposed to like, like give him some inspiration or some, some I'm not acting like I know everything? What, what are we doing? One question. What's the question? What's the question? Why do you love this so much? Why do I love this so much? Because uh, I think the highest form of like happiness to me is creation. Like mm -hmm. once you or stable financially whatever like yes. everybody wants to like create you know yes. like that's the thing that people are missing and um yeah i mean i just love that it's given me an ability to do what you love yeah do what i love and like inspire other people through it in a way that's it's different from like a physique it's mm -hmm. different from like that like this is stuff that's really attainable and mm -hmm. it just takes practice and an eye for i don't even know just like it takes like an eye of like never being satisfied with uh, like the hunger. Your, um, the hunger of it, yeah.
and it's cool because it's just limitless like there's no maximum physique there's no like that's just example because we are involved with bodybuilding and stuff like there's no maximum like i can always take it to another level yes. and i'm always more happy than anything to do it and meeting the people that i can work with and just showing them the final product is probably what i love the most yeah. about it and having like the reaction of somebody just appreciating what you've done mm -hmm. and it makes them be like wow like you make me look so cool i love making people happy about themselves so that's probably something yeah <laughs> oh <my God>. okay. <laughs> Fucking a, man. It's, it's hilarious because when you came to the scene you were posting with max it's it's when i worked with vaughn at the time uh -huh. we were just watching like he's like you were raising the bar yeah. <laughs> so it was crazy because from, I mean, I've been doing this for a minute. I've been doing this since 2019, that lit. Oh. And it's just like, the the pinnacle was David. Mm -hmm. He was known for his cinematography. And then it was Calvin. Yeah. And then for a while, it was me and Ant with the LA prep series. Uh -huh. And then it, there was like a lull. There was nothing really new going on. Yeah. And then all of a sudden, <laughs> you came, like, you just popped up. And then, I mean, you didn't actually Thank you, dude. Yeah, it's crazy like to have, because I never really notice, I, I just work so much. I never really like sit and like look at what I've done much. And whenever my friend was like, I just done the David Lade collection thingy. And I looked back and I was like, wait, the only other like person who's on social media, I think that's like been an influencer. That's also like a videographer and stuff. That's worked with Jim Sharp. Mm -hmm. It's like Sam Colder. That's it. I'm like, that's fucking Sam. Like, I got into this shit because I would watch his videos a bunch. Loves him. And the fact that I'm able to have the opportunity to, like, work with mm. them is just nuts. And that, like, really made me realize that you should give yourself, not like an ego, but you should give yourself credit for what you've done. And it's really crazy that I've been able to, to, to do this. It's sick. But I'm so grateful for it. And, like, all the people I've met just great people and like lifelong connections i can say like one word of advice for people is if you're like are making content you can't just be a videographer you need to be able to like talk to people and have relationships because relationships is really what builds the fun of it as well like it's cool to make the videos but like talking to david behind the scenes like yes. all that stuff like that's the part that's really story with you yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. it's funny jesse when I worked with him, the biggest thing he instilled in me was when you make a video, two things. You want to have a story, but then you also wanted to provoke emotion in like any direction. Yeah. And like since then that like stopped. Mm -hmm. And every single time I watch your show, I'm just like, oh, get thank it you, dude. Oh. <laughs> thank but you. Thank you, man. Thank you. Yeah. On. Thank you guys. That's the easy way to wrap up vlog 37. Vlog 38 will start at the block party once again, and I will see you guys later today.